Hey everyone, I just wanna take a moment and share with our vision builders uh, some of the vision that God has given Pastor Joanne and I for 2023. And, uh, and let me just begin by saying thank you to all our amazing vision builders. Our vision builders, uh, we refer to as the entrepreneurial arm of Creative Church. And because of their generosity and their gift of generosity, uh, we're able to reach out and grab things and bring them uh, into reality, reach into the future and bring them into reality here at Creative Church. So what would normally take us 20 years, we can do it in 10. What would normally take us 10 years, we could do in five because of our vision builders. And so thank you so much, uh, all of you who uh, make the pledge, give your best, and then fulfill those pledges uh, over the course of that year. Same with Joanne and myself. And uh, we love you. We couldn't do this without you. And Pastor Joanne and I uh, just want you to know how much we love you on behalf of our, our staff, our board, all of our leaders, and most importantly, all of those who call Creative Church. Another thing that God began to reveal to our heart, and let me just say too, when we share vision, it's not anything we just bring up quickly. This is something Pastor Joanne and I have prayed over, labored over, dealt with uh, over and over again with conversations, discussions with pastors, leaders, our board. And we spent about a year seeking the heart of God, praying about it, trusting Him to speak to us before we would ever bring this to you. Uh, but one of the things that He's spoken to us is to finally start uh, Creative Church's own worship sound. And we want to be able to produce our first single in 2023, whether it's one or two or three songs. But I want you to think bigger than just a few songs. I want you to think about uh, creating a culture, and it'll take several years, to create a culture of worship, of a sound that comes out from Creative Church that's tied to the sermons and the words that God is speaking to us right here within our own families. And a sound that brings healing ointment and healing medicine to a generation, to our nation, and to the world. And this is something that we're gonna actually back all the way into our junior high ministry and take several years to really develop a culture of writing songs, developing worship albums, where this is something that just becomes a part of our church his DNA and it comes out every year as God is speaking to us here at Creative Church. So a sound, a sound, a sound uh, that God's going to speak to us here at Creative Church that's going to bring healing to so many different people. On December 11th, that Sunday, we're going to do our best to fulfill that pledge in our offering, our vision, build our offering once a year. And then the next 12 months, we're going to believe God to help us fulfill anything we couldn't fulfill on the 11th. You know, if we do the difficult, God has always done the impossible. And I'm now gonna ask you to do what I've asked every vision builder to do over the last decade, and that's simply to pray. I'm not here to guilt anybody, manipulate anybody. It's my opportunity to share the vision, but it's your opportunity to decide the pace at which that vision becomes a reality. And I'm asking you to go to God and simply ask Jesus what he would have you to do. And as a pastor, I'm gonna encourage you, always do whatever Jesus tells you to do. And like I said earlier, if we do the difficult, if we all just do what Jesus tells us to do, if we all stretch a bit, if we all, if we all just press in in faith, God will do the impossible. We love you all. Our hearts and prayers are with you.